What's up, YouTube? It's Fitzbro, and we've got some early access here to the Knights of the Mediterranean DLC for Age of Empires 3 Definitive Edition, and we have been playing a little bit of Malta, and Chat and myself were wondering, what are the unique church upgrades you can get? As we know, most European civilizations all have the, uh, the upgrade to your church, which gives you some unique improvements. So we're going to be taking a closer look at that and some of the civilization bonus, uh, which revolves around their infantry. You see some auras here. So we're going to talk a little bit more about that and how it works, at least to how we understand it so far. Uh, leave a comment below if you think you have uh, any further clarification on this or if you've got any questions about how it works. Okay, so here we have two of the unique infantry units which are trained out of your hospital. This building does actually heal and has some attack um, unique here to Malta. Uh, but we have the Sentinel, which is essentially your musketeer unit. And we have your Hospitaller, which is uh, kind of like your uh, your Haub or your Doppelsoldner type unit. Um, and you see they've got these little rings. So if we look at the uh, uh, their abilities here, Deflection, it absorbs some of the damage inflicted to nearby allies. And this unit runs faster when near own an ally's building. So you see right now he has five attack speed compared to my uh hospital in the middle who is 4.5 uh i'm sorry not attack but just overall speed so that is a big uh difference in speed there um and then if we take a look at our sentinel sentinel is a unique unit who can build outposts out on the field which is kind of similar to your late game uh usa what you might have uh, you know done with uh with your skirmishers and they also have an ability here. This unit is stronger near own and allied buildings. So let's look at, look at these stats and how they stack up. So this Sentinel has 194 HP and 29 attack and 18 siege. 4.25 speed. The one out here has 160 HP, 24 attack and 4.25 speed. So you see that is uh, same speed um, as far as that's concerned. Um, but that is a significant difference uh, when you consider this attack. Now, I think they'll get the boost now that I have built the, uh, yeah, now that I built this outpost. So that's part of some incentive to build your outpost on the field. But uh, I'm going to delete that just so we can see the difference between those stats again. Um, so yeah, there's the uh, the not close to allied building. Here's what it looks like when you're close to an allied building. So big difference. Um, so particularly a defender's advantage or if you're building a forward base kind of advantage. But there's also some cards, some, some text that's going to impact that. So let's take a look at our advanced uh, church card. So we're going to send that here. That's available in the second age, Papal Bull, uh, which increases Maltese unit hit points by 2%, um, which is the case for all unit shipments. Gives your Maltese units plus 2% hit points. That's a unique civ bonus so let's build get papal bull there okay and so now if you look at our church uh you can get teutonic knights which improves the hospitaler damage but they move significantly slower so that's going to change your damage of these guys but they're going to move slower and then you have crusader knights sentinels and hospitalers now also gain their benefits near enemy buildings and that's the one that i think is probably a pretty good benefit so you're going to be getting that pretty significant uh stat boost when you get close to an enemy building so we'll start walking on over there and uh let's go send those cards or those improvements rather now in age three you've got this the knights of the hospital spawn one hospitaler at each of your hospitals currently on the map this costs 250 food and isn't available until the third age i find it to be rather underwhelming like yeah these aren't cheap units but it's like who's gonna have more than two or three barracks like yes they heal okay my units are gonna die quickly but you can see uh they've got those additional stats right now since they are um, near enemy buildings so there you have it. Those are the unique abilities for uh, your Sentinel and your Hospitaller. And you can always take a look at that there. Um, they've added these tooltips in game when you get access to this. Don't forget your Sentinel can build those outposts. And there's a number of cards that uh, impact these units. Um, and of course, if you want to play close to your Hospitals, you will heal uh, when you are not in battle. So they will get a little passive healing if you're sitting there idle. And as far as the unique church and those units go, um, those are the benefits. There's some different cards you can get for those, which we can talk about maybe later in a future guide. But uh, hope that 
I hope you learned something about Malta. And let me know if you have any questions as I'm exploring these civilizations. And of course, you can catch us over live on twitch.tv slash Fitzbro. Make sure you hit that sub button for plenty more AOE3 action. See you in the next one, guys.